I was in uh, Mr. Schneider's office and he's going, I want you to play something for me. And I'm like, and he goes, Aquaman. And I'm like, pardon me? <laughs> that was the biggest shock, one of the biggest shocks in my life. <laughs> Ezra, do you have a, do you uh, Yes, I was in a small town in Costa Rica, Yoravida, and was eating some sort of delicious fish. And I received a call, uh, and it was my agent, and he was very panicked. And he said, I have Zack Snyder on the phone, he wants to talk to you, I don't know why. <laughs> and I said, hold on, this fish is quite delicious, give me another moment. And then I said, okay. And I plucked a bone from between my teeth, and I said, I'm ready. And Zack Snyder came on the phone, and he's like, I'm a big fan of your work. Listen, I have this idea, it's a crazy idea. Why don't you play the Flash? And I started having a conniption. You know what a conniption is? I do, yes, I'm from the South. I had a full one, a, a full, he realized conniption. Exactly. Right there, and people, and the Costa Rican people were alarmed. <laughs> this man's crazy, he's screaming and spitting fish bones everywhere. <laughs> Meanwhile, that was valid for them to think that. <laughs> Ray, what about you? Where was I? I was in my apartment, and I get a call, I'm reading another script, because I'm thinking, man, I probably bombed that Justice League audition, I'm never gonna get the role. And I get a random call uh, from Zach's assistant saying, hey, uh, Zach wanted to talk to you briefly. I was like, oh, he's probably just calling me to tell me, oh, well, thanks, but, you know, we're going in a different direction. Uh, he gets on the phone, he's like, so? Looks like we'll be making a movie. And I go, <laughs> I said a bunch of words I can't say because this is a PG uh, audience right now. And I started roll I literally started rolling around on the floor. But I think he called me just to hear that reaction. Because usually, usually you, you, you know, you send it through the agent or the manager and they're the ones that break the news, but he wanted to be the one to tell personally. And you know, uh, it's just a testament to the kind of guy that he is. So, you know, he's with us, even though he's not with us. Um, wow. yeah. none of us, and none of us would be here without him.